Love is in the air. If a romantic trip to see the kiss in Vienna is not on the cards, the painting can come to you. The Belvedere Museum has launched the sale of a limited number of digital cutouts of what is probably the most famous depiction of lovers, just in time for Valentine's Day, so you can make a digital declaration of love. Every owner can dedicate uh, and show his love to someone with this NFT. We do not only make a copy of the original, but we divide it in 10,000 pieces uh, and each piece is an image for itself. The NFTs, short for non-fungible tokens, can be purchased up until Valentine's Day for around $2,100 each. It's an effort to reach unconventional art collectors as well as people who are not normally museum goers. If the trend continues, it will disrupt the traditional art market, but of course not replace it, but complement it. Crypto economics expert Alfred Daudes highlights the rapid growth of NFT sales. While its market volume amounted to $100 million for the entire year of 2020, it now stands at $4 billion per month. But digital art can be vulnerable to fraud. One problem of these open NFT marketplaces is that uh, you don't have an identity and proof of authenticity. Because basically everybody can copy uh, a digital file and claim that he's the author. So-called closed NFT marketplaces usually provide better protection against scams while still offering an opportunity for artists to sell their digital work directly. And for the museum, it could provide much needed funds. If by Valentine's Day all digital parts of the KISS painting are sold, the Belvedere earns more than $20 million. This is about two-thirds of the museum's annual turnover.